first step. Good morning, team. Thanks for checking in for the next Kilograms Kilometers podcast and continuing on with lunge week. And in terms of progression, I know we've probably talked about it before, but uh, the first step after split squats, getting getting familiar, getting comfortable with the the range of the step or your foot position. Um, you know, a lot of times some folks go a little more narrow, whatever. But once you get the once you get comfortable with where the foot where it's best for your foot position to be, then in terms of adding movement, starting with a reverse lunge would be kind of the first move. Um, or at least in terms of, of our progression, everyone has their own ways, but our progression going to the reverse lunge, uh, because one, it's going to be, uh, you're, you're at least lowering down on a, on a stable platform. So if I'm stepping back with my right leg, my left foot's already planted, uh, and therefore it's just decelerating or controlling that lowering movement. So, uh, and then of course on the drive back, a lot of that drive being on the front foot and so that front foot getting that drive off that push uh, just as if it was a bit more of an acceleration or first step uh, versus going to a forward lunge moving forward so now if i'm stepping forward with the right foot the right foot's taking on a lot more movement a lot more uh, momentum and then therefore you're you're emphasizing a little bit more the deceleration uh, so uh, again, if, if it's something you're not comfortable with, then a lot of folks tend to get a little more instability or movement, uh, especially in the ankle, the knee, uh, as they're lowering down into that forward step. Uh, so again, first step would be, uh, or first progression would be the, the reverse lunge. So again, you've got a, a solid planted foot and then uh, you're controlling down into that. And then after, let's say, three, four weeks, then progressing to that forward lunge uh, <clears throat> in terms of just advancing through the movements. So uh, we'll we'll cover a few more variations. And then, of course, um, even just how to vary that up, not just within a, a program itself, but uh, individual workouts and that sort of thing as the week goes on. But again, if you have any other questions about uh, lunges specifically, uh, and hit us up, let us know, send us an email, put lunges or lunge in the subject line so we know what you're talking about. And we'll be sure to connect, brainstorm, share whatever intel, uh, information, or tips we can. Other than that, let's keep the week rolling. Let's keep working.